take the next one which is polygon now we know that there are rectangles we know there are squares we know there could be an octagon so let's say this is a hexagon and then we also know that there could be certain figures like this now if you notice the difference between this this and this and this now the first three are made entirely of lines so here you have one two three and four lines again same you have one two three four five six lines here you have one two three four lines but you also have a semicircle so basically a polygon is a figure is a what do you call a figure or what do you what what's the word you want to use it okay polygon is a figure which is made up entirely of line segments so you just have lines here you don't have a semicircle so this is not a polygon why because this has a semicircle now if you were to divide this into two part then basically this is a polygon but adding this to it will ensure that this doesn't becomes a polygon so let me explain to you certain concepts relating to the polygon let us say i'm sorry let us say i draw a polygon a b c d e and f now there are vertic various stuff which you know you need to kind of know because these are important each of this segment say bc or cd or ed or ef so we know there are six of them 1 2 3 Four, five, six. All these six are basically called the sides of polygon. So BC is a side of side of polygon. CD is a side of polygon. So whenever you work in your geometry, you will be told that there is a line segment AB. AB side. There are two adjacent sides. So when do you mean sides? You mean one of these lines, and then it will be denoted by a name right now you would notice that if i were to consider ab and bc they meet at this point i guess i need to use a different color now this point where two lines of a polygon meet are known as vertex and because the point where these are meeting is b so you call it as vertex b right similarly if you see slide ed and cd meet at d so you call this as vertex d so a vertex is a point where a pair of slides sides 
meet vertex point where pair of sides meet say ed and cd at vertex d okay this is about the vertex now any two sides which are following in continuity say ed and cd are called the adjacent side adjacent you know how often do your ma'am say okay go and sit adjacent to this person go and sit adjacent to this person which means by the side so similarly ed and cd are adjacent sides right then your ed and ef are also adjacent sides and so on okay and then the last thing which you need to know here is about the diagonals now we told that ed and cd are basically adjacent sides similarly c and d are adjacent vertex also but if you join any of the other vertex which are not adjacent to each other let's say you have vertex f and you have vertex c now if you join the two of them together this line which joins them together is called the diagonal so diagonal is a line which joins two vertex which are not adjacent right so these are some of the things that you supposed to know about polygons and these are the ones which are going to tremendously help you in your mathematics through your career